Hey there, it's Elizabeth and welcome back to another glue book video. Okay, so today I am actually going to go through this stack right here. We'll see how far we get. And we're going to, whoops, don't need that there. And we're going to um, decide uh, how we're gonna cut these out and where we're gonna store them. Okay, so I'm gonna move some of this stuff off camera, but I just wanted to show you. In this basket right here, which I'm not gonna be doing today, is uh, fussy cutting, okay? so. Here are some fussy cut images, big and small, that I have in here. Still need to get sorted, so we'll move that out of the way. This right here is um, a bunch of different squares and rectangles of the smaller size, okay? So we'll just put that up there because I need to move this up, okay? In here are squares and rectangles. In here is, yeah, anyway. Um, it, this is an English class, people. So. In here I have bigger squares and rectangles, so that goes up there. In here I just have some words and phrases, and I also have these that so that I can keep the longer words and phrases, so that's going up here. That's going up here, okay. In here I have bigger squares and rectangles, right? And in here I have uh, even bigger, like rectangles and squares, okay? So that is how we are going to cut and sort today. So let's just see how we're gonna do this, all right, shall we? Okay, let's make sure you're in frame. Okay, I like this right here. So we are using the paper trimmer. Again, just checking to make sure you guys can see everything. Okay, my goodness, I need to clean this thing out. Okay, I love Nashville. We took a trip three years ago and absolutely loved it. Okay, so love this right here look at that beautiful cityscape now this i'm not really sure this okay all of these pictures came i do believe from garden and gun magazine all right now i don't know if you can see it but i can see through to the other side uh so when you glue it down you might be able to see you might not i'm not sure i don't really care in all honesty okay so this is going to go into bigger rectangles all right I love this music heels, love that. Sorry, I'm sniffling because I just sneezed. Okay, this is going in the large basket for words. And then I'm gonna attempt to go right on that line there because there are some of these smaller pictures that I do like, okay? Again, attempting to cut it right on the line. I don't want any of that. Don't need any of that. Garbage. Okay, don't care to have food. Do I want closet? No. Um, this dude here playing the guitar, the electric guitar, yes. Um, I much prefer using my jank, um, whatever this is, paper trimmer, yeah. So this is gonna go into the smaller rectangles and squares. And I like this cityscape too. So we'll just cut that off. Isn't that nice? I don't know what it is. Ooh, there was a watch on the back. Um, anyway, I like, I would much rather use my paper trimmer, just saying. Okay, so this one right here, I remember when I cut it out, I'm going to fussy cut her for my journal. So that's gonna go in a different pile to remind me of that, okay. Now this one here is of the barrels because apparently there are a lot of drunkards in the South. I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding, I don't really know. All I know is that due South, there's a whole bunch of bourbon drinking going on according to this magazine, all right? Just saying, okay. Uh, there are some words down here. All I really care about are the barrels because I think that is a cool picture, okay, of the barrel. So that's gonna go in that basket with the medium sort of size. Okay, love this picture right here. Let me just check the back to make sure. Okay, just books, which I love, but don't need them. Okay, now, just as a tip, okay, this is how I do it. I, I mean, everybody has their own thing. Some people prefer using um, scissors. I do not, I do not, okay? So I use my paper trimmer and I just like chop off the top, right? Then I use these lines as guides 
to sort of hopefully make a straight line when I'm cutting the picture out, right? So then I turn it this way. I don't even know if you can see that at the bottom. Yeah, you can, okay. So that's how I line it up, you know? So that way I don't need, I don't necessarily need, um, you know, to, to measure it or, or to cut it with, you know, um, I don't know, with scissors or whatever. Okay, all that in there, love that. Okay, that is going in this one, okay. I love this and I haven't decided what I wanna do. There's a daddy and his daughter, which there are a lot of things that I could use this for, so I'm setting that aside for possible journal use. Um, I really like this, is this, no. Okay, I've gotta go this way. I like um, using my trimmer against the edge and then using this here as a guide as well. Okay, so, and then, oh, let's see here. Hmm, okay, fine. You gonna be that way? Fine, okay. I'm trying to make straight edges. That's what you see me doing here. So, excuse me for the sniffles again. I just sneezed in the last video that I was filming, so I like that. I like those colors. Okay, that is going to actually go in this basket, okay, with the bigger rectangles and squares. Guiding presence, love that. So we're just gonna go ahead and cut that out. And I am also, yeah, I'm just showing you how I go about cutting my images Again, I enjoy using my paper trimmer versus just uh, scarily using just a pair of scissors, okay? Guiding presence, love that. That is going in this long bin. Oh, and if you're wondering where I got these blue bins from, I got them from the Dollar Tree. And I thank uh, Brooke for telling me and showing me because then I went and got it, okay? I went and got them. And they're great for sorting images. And the other thing that's good too is, um, just so you know, a little commercial break here. Um, another thing that's good is that, that not only are they stackable one on top of each other, but they're also stackable in here. Okay, let's see if any, if this will, yeah, see? So, and then there's another like bigger one that I haven't been able to find, but if you get the bigger one for large ones, it'll fit all of these in there, like all stackable, you know? Okay, fabulous organizational idea, okay? So let's just get these back where they belong. Sorry for the reach and all that jazz. All right, and the sniffles again. The people who help shape us might not always be with us long, but a wild spirit can live on forever. Okay, I like that. <clears throat> Excuse me, I'm sorry. Gosh, jeez. Y'all probably used to it by now. And I know a lot of you just, you know, um, always, you know, you always tell me about my, um, I guess, what what is it like my apologizing? Like I don't need to apologize. I don't know, maybe that's the Southern in me. <laughs> I always, I always apologize. I don't know why. Okay, that goes in the long bin. All right, now let's see what I can do here with this, all right? I love lobster so much. All right, I like the word dreaming, so we're just going to cut it out right at the center, and then we'll see what we're left with, all right? We're just gonna see what we're left with. All right, and today I'm filming, like yesterday I filmed all day long. My poor husband, he didn't see me almost the whole day. And then, um, and then this morning I told him that, you know, I'd come in here and work a little while, even though I'm supposed to be working on journaling pages, that ain't happening. Okay, dreaming, love that. And that's gonna go in this smaller box of whatever's. Um, okay, any of this? No, I don't need that. I don't think, I don't care to have. Oh, I could use this though. Okay, yeah, it always pays to look at both sides. <laughs> Before you toss out. All right, before you toss it out, look at both sides. I don't think I need flowered yoga pants, but I do like this palm tree. Okay, what was I saying? Oh yeah, um, don't need this. This is gonna go in my smaller rectangle thing. Okay, yeah, my poor husband. <laughs> he was neglected yesterday. I neglected him. 
because I was trying to get as many videos. I need to get back on schedule for my videos. Um, so today I told him that I'd work in here until about noon. This, cute, right? This won't fit in that one, so I'm just gonna put it in this one here. And I, nah, I don't, ooh, lighthouse. Okay, <laughs> squirrel, yeah, that, this I can use. Yeah, so I told him that I would work in here for a couple of hours with you guys, even though I'm supposed to be working on my journal, but I'm not, BTW. Um, and then I would, I would go out there and relax with him. Okay, so this goes in here. Great picture. This I'm not sure about, okay? This so reminds me of my sweet friend Allison, just how colorful it is. So, and then it has some really cool pictures on the other side as well. So I might send this to her, I don't know. And I love this too. So I might send this to her as well. Cause it's just fun and colorful and beachy and all of that. So I'm gonna put that aside for an I don't know what I'm doing kind of page. Now, I liked like the words on here and the lettering and I really like her, but the words are invading the picture, which I'm not a fan of. So I think I'm just gonna cut this out um, and you know, just leave the rest. So yeah. Yeah, anyway. Yeah, so I thought I'd just bring you along just to show you how I go about cutting these things out. It, it doesn't take long and you guys are helping me to not procrastinate and have just stacks of papers, you know, on my desk. This goes in here. It's a nice little heron, it looks like. Okay, this one, I like this part right here. Oh, and I think it was in the last video that I did. Um, I don't really, I don't care for people. I don't know. I don't know. I'm weird about that. And maybe later on, I, it all depends on the person, I guess. I don't know. Anyway, that's a pretty picture. It reminds me of Santorini, but it's some kind of beach somewhere, somewhere in the South. Um, this is going to go into here and I forgot what I was saying. This I wanted to save cause it's so super cute. Reminds me of my daughter. Um, so this is staying here in another pile. Love this, okay, love this. I don't know how I'm going to use it though. I'm not sure, I think I might end up fussy cutting this out. I love that though t as well, but I did decide, I think, that that I wanted this side of it. And like I said, I'm just not sure if I wanna keep it like this for my book. Oh, let's cut off that ripped piece there. Or if I want it for just to fussy cut these people out, cause that is such a fun picture. I mean, I know I say I don't like people in my things, but I love this. Yeah, okay, so this has to go in a separate pile cause I don't have a bin big enough for it. All right, but I also like these words too. It's beautiful out there. And they're talking about Savannah, Georgia. And that is a place I don't believe I have ever visited, but let's see here. Yeah, I'm gonna cut this side off first. It's really hard when you're working with a paper trimmer to cut these things, these smaller words, but if you do it like this, <laughs> And I don't really know how to explain it, but there, see, it's just as easy to cut it like that. Okay, that goes in the word bin. This isn't ordinary. Okay, I like that. So I'm going to take this and then this is gonna get a little hairy here because, yep, there we go. Did it. Okay, garbage. And we're going to cut this little bit off. Yep, I use my paper trimmer for everything. And I've had this thing forever. And yes, I do realize that I use it upside down. <laughs> I don't know why. I really don't know why. It's just how I've always used it. Okay, that goes in the small. This isn't ordinary. Yeah, my life isn't ordinary. Okay, so this one here, where one dream becomes a thousand memories. I like that. 
I like that. Oh, and I like that too. Okay, so this is what I was gonna do on this. Oh, did I even finish that thought? Before, I told you when I'm stacking these like this, I put the things that I want the most on top so that when I'm going through them to do this, to cut them out, I know, uh, you know, which photos or, you know, what I'm looking for, I know right, of what, right away, you know. And I do try to do it, um, that goes in the word bin. I try to cut out my stuff, you know, as soon as possible from when I uh, chose it, you know, from when I, let me think what I'm trying to say, from when I harvested it in a magazine, I try to cut them out and sort them as soon as possible so that I don't forget and then get to the stack later. And I'm like, wait a minute, what on earth was I thinking? Like, why did I even, you know, cut that out? Okay, I'm putting that one in there. Just checking on the time, all right? And if you can see what is going on. All right, I know for this one I liked, put yourself in the way of wonder and she will follow you home. I like that. I also happen to like this right here. Huh, okay, let's see what we can do here. Now I'm cutting her head off. Sorry, sorry lady. But your head's in the way. Okay, so we're gonna cut that like that and cut the poor dog's legs off. Oh, sorry, Fido. So sorry, so sorry. Okay, and we're going to cut this about right there. Okay, there's my phrase, goes in the phrase box. I don't need green grass, though I could use this like as a background or something like that. Um, in fact, I could use this right here, but I don't know how that would look with, let's just find out, shall we? Uh, right about there. I think it would look weird, but we're gonna find out. Yeah, I don't like that. Okay, but I do like this little pier here with the pup. So let's see, let's see how this will work out. Okay, if we cut that and then we're gonna have to cut it like right close to those words and see how it looks. Okay, I sort of like that. All right, so that's gonna go in there, I guess. I don't know, okay. These are super cool. I really like these when I saw them. So we're gonna cut this little edge off here to make our lives easier. Okay, we can line this up here. And sometimes, I mean, believe it or not, it could be my trimmer, let's just face it, but sometimes even the magazines like aren't straight. I don't know. Maybe, I'm sure it's user error. I don't know. I don't know which, but anyway, I like these photos. I think they're fun. I think they are fun. Look at that old steering wheel, super fun. Uh, old something, I don't even know. Oh, that's the side of the car, super cool. Here's the car itself. I just think they're interesting photos and I think they would look great in a blue book, whoops. Okay, um, so there's that. Okay, love those, love those, those are fun. So those go in the medium size, okay. These I liked for this right here. Yeah, that's it. That's it. So we're gonna line this puppy up and chop it up. <clears throat> I love pictures of the ocean and the beach and oh, so much fun, yes. Okay, that goes in the little box. Don't care to have her on her bicycle. As cute as she is, but okay. Oh, this one I was gonna cut gems out, but I love this right here. So we're going to cut this. I mean, how fabulous is that for a giant glue book? Yes, please. Okay, we're just gonna cut the edge off just to make sure it's squared up. That's gorgeous. I hope you can see it. Okay, that goes in the bigger bin. Gems I'm putting in my other pile for my journal. This I'm putting in the pile because I wanted to fussy cut it. 
this I'm putting in the journal because this would make a super cute background for a like summer journal page, okay? Oh, and look at those crabs there, yeah, okay. This right here I liked because of the colors in it. So let's just check the back real fast. No, okay. So we're just gonna line, ooh, our pile's getting a little bit smaller. I don't know that I'll get through the whole pile. Th this is, um, these piles are so, they are the uh, harvest of the last two Garden and Gun magazines that I went through with y'all in previous videos. Look how fun that is. Look at all that color. Okay, it won't fit in there, so I'll put it in there. All right. This, um, okay, we're just gonna cut it out into a square because I just like the color on it. And I kind of, you know, I like the design of it. I think it's cool. I could probably use that, but good grief, Elizabeth, you have enough bits, all right? You don't need to save every single bit. You just don't. You just don't. And I'm not gonna. Don't tell anyone. All right. Yeah, I like that. That's pretty. I like that. All right. Now, this here, I have to cut this out, which really annoys me. But I'm going to do it anyway. Let's see. My husband probably, like, listens to me yammer on to you guys. And it's like, good grief, woman. Do you ever shut up? And that answer would be no. So that's why I come on here and I yammer to all of you. So he doesn't have to deal with it. Okay, that's nice. I like that, that fits right in there. Don't care for seafood platter. Um, bicycling, I don't know. Okay, I kind of like this down here. This little waterfront area right here. And that's cool. These beautiful waterfront homes. Oops, let's cut that ragged edge off. I don't need any raggedy edges here. All right, I've got enough raggedy edges. All right, I do like this, but it, when I cut off this part right here, hmm, do I still like it? No, I do not. Okay, there you go. Bye, bye-bye, bye-bye. Okay, feed your soul. I like this for words. Yes, I do. So we'll go in here, cut these off. Like I said, it, it's just, it's easier for me to go ahead and cut and file these as, you know, feed your soul, lovely, in my big word pile. I don't know if I want this or not. I guess so. It is a cool picture, I have to say. Um, that's that's cool. I like it. I like it. Okay, that's a big one. Okay. Um, let's see if there's anything. Come. Okay. Uh, um, what was I saying? Yeah. It's, it's easier to just go ahead on here. I liked this one right here. Possibly the other one too. I don't know. We'll see. But yeah, I, I do like to come in here fairly soon after I've harvested and go ahead and cut the images out and just file them already, you know, cause there is nothing more annoying than wanting to glue book and, and or collage or whatever and not having your stuff at the ready, okay? And you know who taught me that? My sweet friend, Nicole. Yep, from Relax Cut Glue, will that fit in there? Yes, it will, okay, yay. Yeah, she has all of her stuff and she's really the one that has inspired me of late, um, <clears throat> excuse me, I'm sorry, to do glue booking, you know? Okay, why did I have this? Where your, sen where your sense of adventure meets your taste up for luxury. Okay, I think I wanted just sense of adventure, but I'm gonna cut out the whole thing. So yeah, but um, at any rate, she she is the one who has really, really inspired me lately. No, we're gonna, okay. What are we doing here, Elizabeth? What are we doing? Okay, we're gonna cut this part off just to make a straight edge. Whoops, sorry about that. And then we're gonna cut this part off. There we go, excuse me. And then we're gonna cut that part off. We'll put this in the long bin. I'm not, I don't know. I think I will keep that after all. 
anyway, yes, I was saying that Nicole has inspired me so much to go ahead and, um, you know, have your things ready at the ready, okay? Deep knowledge, unmatched experience. That is what I liked on this page. So I shall keep this part. Okay, that goes in my in my large word bin. Let's see, I think I like that. Yeah, that looks good, huh? Okay, we'll put that in that bin. I don't think I can really use this for anything. I'm sure somebody could, but. Um, I ha Guys, I have so many magazines that it's not even funny, so. Let yourself be transported, that is what I wanted. Oh, let's cut the top off while we're here. Okay. Yep, it is so much, or it is so helpful, I don't know. I like this, but again, with the people, I don't know. Like if she just wasn't there, okay, there we have it, we'll cut her off. How about that? You're cut off, bam. Okay, and then we're gonna cut off this part right here. Yeah, I like that with the, just the little bird. Fabulous, okay, see? Um, okay, not sure. Um, okay, I'm gonna cut these words off, I think. Please inquire, no, I don't need that. So I'll cut these words off and let's see how this looks for like a longer picture, right, on a book. That's nice. Yeah, in case I had a space for a longer picture. An island apart, blah, blah, blah. I thought I might have wanted these. Hmm. Okay, we're just, you know, we're gonna keep them. We're gonna keep them. We don't, and you know, whatever we do keep as we're going through them at a later date while we're gluing or, or whatnot, you can always decide then that you actually don't want it. <laughs> You know, like I don't care to have the girl and her dog, even though it's, you know, it's a semi-cute page or picture, but I do like these three little, these three little kids here because it's just a cute picture. All right, so those are cute. Okay, sitting by the dock of the bay, huh? All right. I like this picture, but um, hmm. yeah, I think I was I was definitely going to use this. Um, and I don't care that there's a 120 there. It doesn't bother me. Not in the grand scheme of things, because I could always, as I'm glue booking or whatever, <clears throat> See how uneven that is? Well, you probably can't, but I can. Um, yeah, look at that. That's cool. And see, you can hardly even see that. Besides which, if I, you know, when I do go to glue book, I want this bottom ocean picture or whatever picture it is. Um, you know, when I go to glue book or whatever, it, um, you know, you're not gonna be able to see it, or I could always put something over top of it. So no biggie, right? I'm gonna cut this part off. Oh, you know what? And then I'm gonna cut this part off. And I got like two pictures out of that, right? That's nice. So this goes in smaller rectangles, this goes in the bigger rectangles, this goes in the garbage. Not sure what I'm gonna do with this one. Not really sure. Um, Although I do think that I want this bottom part because that's just fun. Okay, I don't know. I'm gonna put this in my journal pile because I'm not sure. Don't want this fish, sorry. Um, I did want this. Um, you guys saw me take this out the other day. Okay, I do like this. I just cut off the words and toss them, because I don't need the words. But I do like this picture. I'm gonna trim off this like little ragged edge right there, because that's where I pulled it from the magazine. I like that. That's pretty and relaxing, all except the hanging ducks, but whatever. 
Whatever. Okay. We're getting through with our stack. Oh, and it's only 11. Okay. Ooh, 30 minutes in. Good grief. Okay. Um, I really, really need to work on my journal, my creative daily journal. I have been ignoring it. Oh, I've been ignoring it. Yep. And I don't force myself, just so you know, you know? I don't force myself to work in a journal if I'm just not wanting to work in it. You know what I mean? I just don't do that. Because for me, it becomes, um, you know, it just becomes less fun, you know? And if it's not fun, oh, I don't want people. And if it's not fun, then I'm not gonna do it, you know? So I wait until I am in the mood to work on my journal, and then I work on it and I'm happy dappy, you know? All right, there we go, nice little floral there. Here's another, this is, looks like citrus something or other. Citrus, so cut that out. Um, yeah, so I try not to let my lack of journaling get me down. <laughs> I keep notes on my phone, I collect things, and you know, when I feel like getting involved in it, then I will. But when I, I don't do it if I don't feel like it. Okay, I liked these words here. So, I'm gonna put this in my, I've never had much of a social life. Yeah, that is like, story of my life okay I'm gonna put this though in a different bin because I'm gonna use it for my journal yes definitely okay on here I wanted to use a few of these um, even though that's a cute elderly man um, I don't think I care to have his picture sorry cute elderly man nor do I care to have a fish head yeah nope nope not at all. Okay. All right. So this goes in there. These go in there. <clears throat> Excuse me. I'm sorry. Okay. This. We don't need to be like, you know, that's another reason why, frankly, I like using the paper trimmer because you don't really have to be exact but it's it comes out straight you know by nature you know by nature of the by the nature of the trimmer you know it comes out relatively straight i should i should amend that okay so these i'm not sure you know let me see what was i thinking okay i think i just like this part right here on on this uh, yeah, and it, I think it would lend interest to, um, just, you know, a glue book page, I think, because it, because it's black and white, you know, I think that just looks cool, so we'll put that in there, put this in the garbage, what did I like about this, little things, big moments, love that saying, so we're gonna take that saying. I don't think we're gonna use the pictures on it. Okay. We're gonna take that and put that in the long one. Okay, yeah, I don't think simple pleasures. Yeah. Oh, puppy dog. His name is Scout, I think. You know what I find so hilarious talking about that? Dogs with names, you know? Well, I mean, most dogs have names, but, um. What I think is so funny, like we were watching something. I, in all honesty, I cannot remember what it was we were watching, but what was it? Oh my gosh, it's gonna kill me now. We were watching some program, right? And it had a dog in it, right? <laughs> and then the credits start running and like they change the dog's name for the film, you know? Like, why? 
just please somebody leave it in the comments why do they do that like why would you you know train a dog to come when called right by his name that someone has given him and then why would you then go and put him in a movie and and the movie people feel the need to change his name like i don't get that i think it's hilarious but i don't get it you know i don't i don't understand that so somebody please tell me why like you know my dog's name is jack and he's sleeping next to me because he's a sweetie um his name is Jack, right? Now, if I put him in a movie, that's pretty, isn't it? Oh, that is very pretty. Oh, that's too big. Okay. Like, if I put him in a movie, like, why would I call him Pippin? You know what I mean? Like, I've already trained him to come to Jack or Jackson or Ding Dong. But, I mean, why would I name him something else just to be in a movie? I don't know. It seems very odd to me. All I'm saying. All I'm saying. Okay, I like this bell. I think it's cool. I hope my book is is big enough. Good grief. Um, I told you the other day in some video. Uh, yeah, in fact, it was maybe two glue book videos away or two, back, you know, harvesting. Um, the book that I plan on using is going to be the Arteza watercolor book. So, oh yeah, I wanted to read this article. So I'm going to put this to the side there, but I love that. Oh my God. Is that not beautiful or what? Oh geez Louise. Oh, I would love to have that in my backyard. I would never, I would literally never leave my backyard. Okay. My husband would bring coffee to me in the mornings. <laughs> Yeah, right. No, he would. He probably would if I asked him. That's just, oh my gosh, that is stunning. I hope you can see that without a glare. I don't know, but it's beautiful. Okay, um, well, oh, this I was gonna use as a background or something, so that goes in a different pile. Not sure, but you know what? we got through a good bit of these magazines right and just you know i'm gonna cut it off because we're already at 37 minutes should i finish the stack or not uh, i don't know i'm gonna put that aside yeah we'll just go ahead and finish okay because it's really it's not too many things okay a change of scenery that's what i liked on this page so we're just you're just sticking it out with me, and I do so much appreciate it, if you are. Okay. <clears throat> Excuse me. Ugh. Clearing throat and all. Let's get this done. Let's get it done, because then I will feel as though I accomplished something today. All right, let's see. Water ebbs and flows out of current con. Okay. I think I like that saying too, so I'm just gonna cut that whole thing out and then I'll go back in and fussy cut it later. Your getaway is closer, I like that as well. And again, I'm just gonna cut it off, you know, and then I will fussy cut it later. Okay, let's see, anything else on here? Nope. All right, so let's cut this puppy out. Yeah, we don't have much longer to go. And then there are going to be two magazines done and dusted. Well, maybe not done and dusted, but for now they're done and dusted. Until I go back and search through them again for something else. Maybe something else will catch my mind. That's a cool martini glass. Never had a martini. I don't know. Maybe I've had a taste of one in my lifetime. I'm not really sure. Couldn't tell you could not tell you I love this picture it's so, it's so cute anyway um before I was about to go did I tell you I've decided to make a big glue book out of my Arteza watercolor book yeah so I shall bring you along for that whenever I start it yep can I just tell you it's hot as Hades in my room and I don't know why the fan is on and everything that's more big. Okay, no, good English there. Okay, guiding you through today. That's what I wanted were the words, not this lady that is apparently extremely excited about something. I don't know. 
technology, oh, her finances. She's extremely excited about her financial situation, which, good for you, lady, good for you. Okay, um, there we go. Words, okay, I thought there was something out. Peace of mind, protecting your legacy. Okay, I don't know if I'm in the mood to fussy cut all that stuff, okay. But I did like this here, I remember that. Ooh, this is gonna be a long video. Sorry, sorry, not sorry. Hopefully you guys are gluing along with me or journaling with me or walking, you know. You could take a nice walk and just stick me in your ear if you want. Uh, that just sounded really odd, but you know, whatever. Whatevs. Okay, Elizabeth, let's line this up. And I also need to clean my trimmer too. You know, like this stuff right here in the center, it gets like bits of papers in it and then it makes it like super hard, um, you know, to cut and whatever. Okay, these are super small, so they go in there. Here's this dreaded lionfish. Oh my goodness. Ah, <sighs> little dumb, dumb fish just ruining things, ruining things, I tell you. I wish they could find that one person who brought the dum dum fish over here. They're pretty cool though. They are pretty cool to look at. I don't want them in my ocean, dang it. Okay, oh, whoops, what's here? All right, let's get this done, girl, let's get this done. Okay. All right, Mr. Cowboy, you are adorable, but I'm not gonna put you in my book, I'm sorry. Sorry. Nope. You are a cutie though. But, not going in my book. Okay, here's a, another inside picture of that beautiful greenhouse conservatory thing in Chattanooga, which I need to, I need to ask my sister-in-law where that is. She lives up there. Okay, and all righty. It has a number on it right there. I don't care. I don't care about that. When they're that little, like, no, I don't care. It doesn't bother me. Okay, what did I want? Okay, life's best moments is what I wanted on this one. So we're just gonna quickly cut this puppy out. All right, guys. Oh boy, you guys are really sticking it out to hang with me. If you're still here, <laughs> if you're still here, I really appreciate it. It's been fun. Okay, this goes in my word box. All right, it's been fun, and I I love like you know being productive and stuff. I don't think I'm gonna keep this after all. I'm just not a fan. Now looking back on it again, loved this guy though. The silhouette of him. Um, yeah, not the bourbon. Sorry. Bye. <clears throat> okay, we'll cut off this raggedy edge. I really enjoy silhouettes. I think they're pretty cool. Okay, we'll cut this up here, but then we'll decide later whenever I glue it into a book. I might even just cut them down just so, you know, whatever. I don't know. Okay, he goes in there. Okay, oh, we're on the last page. All right. Um, raise a glass. Jeez, these Southerners, huh? And I can say that because guess what? I'm a Southerner. <laughs> Ooh, Southerners and they're drinking. Anyway, well, some, some of us don't drink. Some of us do. I like some of these words, so I'm just gonna cut the whole thing out and save it. And then of course I like this. I love any kind of water scene, sunset, sunrise, you name it, on the water, whatever. I like it. Okay, and we are done. Final cut, and this is gonna go in here. Okay, so guess what, guys? Yay. Okay, so we can put all of these in here. 
I can actually put that in there and then this can just go on the side for now. See, see how nicely those just like stack up like that. Love it. Okay. I really hope I was in frame for most of that <laughs> and that you enjoyed it. This very long, long yammering video. I enjoyed spending time with you. I can tell you that right now. And thank you for helping me be so productive. So if you like what you see, <clears throat> excuse me, clearing throat and all, please don't forget to click the subscribe button and that notification bell so you can get notified when another video comes out. Um, yeah, I have lots of stuff on my channel, so go ahead and peruse the playlists, okay? And peruse my channel because I do more than glue booking and harvesting. Um, yeah, I do journal with me. I do um, journal flip throughs. My passion is actually um, my creative daily journal. So check all those out if you so desire. Hope to see you back again soon. And have a great day and a wonderful week. And yeah, I'll talk at y'all later. Bye for now.